There was nothing. Oh my god. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. As promised, I am here in the beautiful, beautiful Kending. It is just absolutely gorgeous down here. I drove my scooter down from Kaohsiung. It took a little bit more than two hours, but I am just so happy to be here on the beach with my good friend, Lucas Engstrom. We are down here staying at the Howard Beach Resort and we were lucky enough that they're putting us up for the night. We are going to be exploring their complex today. Apparently there's all kinds of great secret things about this hotel. Exclusive villas. Lucas just mentioned some kind of water park. This is really scary! <laughs> which I don't see how they could have a full-scale water park in that hotel, but we will definitely check that out. They have exercise rooms, all kinds of amenities. The food apparently is very delicious. I can't wait to start exploring this hotel and continue enjoying the beauty of Kending. Wow. We've got a couple of hours before our official tour of the hotel begins, but check out this place I found. I just can't believe the turquoise blue color of that water. I'm not sure if the camera is picking it up, but to my eye and through my sunglasses especially, uh, that water just looks so azure blue. I think in a lot of ways, this part of Taiwan reminds me a lot of Sha Liocho, which I suppose makes sense. They're both in the south of Taiwan and they both are covered in what looks to be ancient coral. It's quite a stunning landscape down here. And even some of the houses are built out of rocks that are quite obviously fossils of coral. It is extremely windy, I apologize for the sound, but it is so worth it. Made it here, another maybe 10 or 15 minute drive after the beach. Don't stop at the beach, keep on going because this is perhaps one of the most beautiful parts of Taiwan that I've seen so far. So just down that way is the southernmost part of Taiwan. Keep on going past that, and then you reach this incredible cliffside. Ila Formosa, the ancient name for Taiwan, which literally translates to beautiful island. And when you come to places like this, you can really understand why. I could probably stay up here forever, but I do have to head back to the Howard Beach Resort to start our tour. If you guys are in Kending, you absolutely have to come and check this out. It is wonderful up here. Lucas just hit a really big milestone. Wait for it. <laughs> All right. Congrats, man. Sweet. Oh. So nice. That's so nice, eh? So nice. Great things happen when we, and me and Wes are together. <laughs> he hit 10,000 when we were shooting in Kaohsiung. I am getting 10,000 down here in Kenting. Yeah, man. Perfect. So proud of you, dude. Thank you all so much for all the support. This is off for a great day, great weekend, and can't wait to enjoy the rest of beautiful Kenting. Yeah, man, it looks amazing. Check Woo! that out. So you quickly realize that the key to these deer's hearts is of course through their stomach. Uh, luckily the hotel does provide uh, bowls of these really fresh, delicious looking carrots that are apparently irresistible to these deer. So. <laughs> Very cute. Can you give her a shot, Lucas? Yes. <laughs> I heard in our last video when I showed you around uh, Taipei, a lot of the comments said that Probably the way to West Heart is through his stomach, so I should have shown him a lot of more delicious food from Taipei. <laughs> and I feel like Wes and these deers have something in common because <laughs> these deer seems to love me right now <laughs> yeah. when I'm feeding them carrots. You are not wrong, man. It should have been more of a food tour. You, it should have been more of a food tour. You chose tour. the wrong activity, all that hiking. Oh, no, that's not a carrot. That's not a carrot. Oh, no. <laughs> it's got the nice eyelashes, eh? Nice long eyelashes. 
Next up on the tour is the Grand Swimming Pool. And she just let me know that this hotel, this pool here, is actually the largest swimming pool in all of Kending. We are now entering the villa section of the hotel and this place looks really fancy. They gave us fresh squeezed grapefruit juice as soon as we walked in the door. Mm. Oh, that's so good. We are really getting the grand tour today. Wow. This first villa she's showing us is the Greek villa and it is absolutely beautiful. All of a sudden it feels like I'm down in Bali, Indonesia. This is just gorgeous. Obviously there's walls separating the villas so you really do feel like you're in your own private space and <laughs> this little swimming pool is really a nice touch as well. I guess this guy's had a long day in the sun. I guess this is life once you pass 10,000 subscribers, huh? <laughs> yeah, welcome to the club, man. I've been doing this for months now. Thanks. <laughs> man, there's no place I really don't want to be right now. Yeah, me too, man. Man, so I showed Wes a great time in Taipei, and he said that he was going to make sure that I had a great time down in southern Taiwan one day. I think this is it. He shows me the life of a 10,000 YouTuber right now. <laughs> it's amazing. As much as I do want to stay here for the indefinite future, uh, we do have more filming to do today. This is the number two villa on our three villa stop. So, I mean, the first two have been amazing. Can't wait to check out the third one. Bar, living room. Oh my gosh. After the Spanish villa, I didn't think it could get better than that. But this villa is astounding. It is truly magnificent. I was just doing a little bit of fantasizing. Imagine just staying in a place like this for a week or two, filming and editing YouTube videos. Man, talk about a dream come true right there. I'm not leaving. I know they were kind enough to give us another room, but this, this villa is something special. I've personally never been to Bali. I've just seen how amazing it looks in other people's travel videos, but uh, suddenly I want to go to Bali. Or I guess the next best thing, just book a room here at the Howard Hotel. I just want one day here, one day in the other villa. Never enough time. Never enough time. I don't even think I'm gonna try to drag Wes out of this one. No. Um, they're gonna be dragging us both. Yeah, they're gonna be dragging both of us out of this one. That concludes our tour of the Bali Villa. Uh, I'm really sad to be leaving. But on to the next part of the tour. We are at the next part of the tour and as if things couldn't get any better This is the private dining area for all the guests who are lucky enough to be staying at the villa or one of the villas Everything is so beautiful um, All the furniture tables they're this beautiful hardwood the decorations are very very authentic and there's lots of cakes and coffee and lots of things like that for the guests to enjoy that bear does not look like me Hi everyone, my name is Wes Davies and today I'm gonna go and have stinky tofu and we're gonna go on a scooter and we're gonna have a great day. <laughs> is that what my channel is? <laughs> Eating stinky tofu, going on scooter trips and being positive. Yeah. Please subscribe to my channel. See you all <laughs> next week. Here we are. These rooms are no longer the villas but they're still very nice. And we're on the side of the hotel called the Mountain Side. And as you can see behind me, this is Kending's famous peak. That is part of Kending National Park. And there's tons of great hiking trails all through there. It's a very beautifully preserved natural area. This hotel just continues to give us little surprises. Uh, she said we're gonna go to the water area. Suddenly we open the door and we are in a full-scale, gigantic water park. Unfortunately, we don't want to get the camera gear wet, so I think we're just gonna head back uh, to the rest of the hotel. Nah, I'm totally kidding. We are absolutely going in this water park. I'm so glad that Lucas and I made this plan to 
come down to Kending. Uh, I do. Here we go. Lucas just went down the green slide, and as soon as he disappeared into the blackness, I just heard him start screaming. Here we go. Ah! Oh my god! Ah! Wow. This is really scary! Ah! Oh my god. That was terrifying. Oh my gosh. They let the kids go on that? This reminds me of my old days filming on this GoPro. Before uh, before I move to Taiwan. Here we go. Here goes nothing. Ah! Oh my god. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Woo! That is wonderful. Oh no. This is not looking good. Ah! My hat came off. That was so much fun at that water park, man. I I haven't had that kind of just unadulterated, like childlike fun for years. That was great. Wow. We are back here at our room after spending that time at that amazing water park. Uh, we're getting a little bit hungry, so we are going to check out what kind of amenities they have at this restaurant down in the lobby. Descending the grand staircase here at the hotel. Can't wait to check out what they've got at the restaurant. Gotta say, we have just been having the best time at the Howard Beach Resort. It was honestly so nice of them to put us up for the weekend. We had a fantastic stay here. Highly recommend this hotel. I've got to drive back to Kaohsiung about two and a half hours, so I better hit the road. Lucas has to catch the high speed back to Taipei. Yep. And hopefully we can hang out again soon, man. It was really fun. Yeah, I feel like now I have showed you guys around both Taipei and my absolute favorite place in Taiwan. So now I'm just waiting for an invitation from Wes. Mm -hmm. So please leave a comment below and see where what, should we go, where we should go, and what Wes should show me next. Sounds good. All right, bye guys. Have a good one. Thank you all so much for watching. See you next time. <laughs>